你好 ，Sylvia， 对不对？对。Maybe you can try to introduce yourself in Mandarin、oh. and English. <laughs> 好，好。Okay, look, first English or first Chinese. 都可以，随便你。Oh. Mm. All right. So in English, hi, my name is Sylvia.、Um, I am American. I live in Kentucky, in Lexington, Kentucky.、Um, I'm 23 years old. My family. I have my mom, my dad, my brother, and me. So just four people. And I've been studying Chinese for about two years now. And、mm. then in Chinese, hello, 大家好。中文名字是玉玲。我是美国人，住在堪塔基。啊、uh, ，我的家有四个人，嗯、爸爸妈妈、弟弟和我。我今年二十三岁，还有我已经学中文学了大概两年了。First question is, how did you know me? Um, I think I started when I first started learning Chinese. I um, I was on YouTube a lot, looking at different videos. So I think I first found your video on YouTube. And subscribe to you there, and then I followed you on Instagram and Facebook, and then eventually did the course. Okay, um, so what what did why did you uh decide to become my student? Um, I think because I had been studying for a while already. Um, like I think I told you, I've been studying for about two years now. Um, and I had been doing other courses which I did enjoy, but I was finding as I was getting to the more Upper, intermediate, advanced levels that there was still a lot that I wasn't really understanding.、Mm. So I thought I need to review before I can progress further. I need to be able to understand this.、Oh. And so I saw your course, and a lot of the lessons that you had were like, "This is what I need." Oh, <laughs> and so、yeah, the, <laughs> the, and so I、um, decided then to.、Um, mm. Sign up, and I'm glad I did. <laughs> oh yeah! So, what did you mean by "this is what I did, what I need"? What What did I do right? <laughs> <laughs> um, I think because you had a lot of specific lessons to the questions that I had, like I was still struggling with understanding like the shoulda structure and the ba structure and. La, <laughs> everybody、mm. has problems with la, <laughs> and so I like that you had several lessons just dedicated to that specifically, and、mm. so I thought I could use this. <laughs> eh, so how long have you been studying with me? Maybe like only、um, maybe just a month or so. It's,、mm-hmm. It hasn't been very long. Yeah, yeah. So it, did you do you notice any any difference or any change before and after you joined the course? I think so.、Um, I do understand a lot of those grammar points a bit better now after seeing how you explained it, because you explained、mm-hmm. it really well.、Uh-huh, um, <laughs> and so that, and also, I found that I really liked your vocabulary lessons too, because、I'd、even、like、though I, too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> even though I'd already like, I thought my vocabulary was okay. I like that you have the homework to make your own sentences, and that helped me to do it a lot better and be like,、mm-hmm. okay. Oh, how to use this word? <laughs>、uh, can you tell me a little bit about your?、Uh, you say you've been learning Mandarin like before me. You were learning Mandarin for two years, right? So,、uh, with a school or with a tutor, or it was just online courses, kind of like yours, but、oh. they were a bit.、Um, they were a bit more like there wasn't a lot of direct interaction with the teacher. It was mainly the videos and like audio lessons, and.、Um, And before that, I when I first started, I used books and like CDs and stuff. But then I did the courses, and、um, then I did yours. <laughs> so you're like all the way, all the way self study,、uh, pretty much, yeah. <laughs> wow, 那你的中文还不错哎。如果是 all the way self study, because I see your sentences. Oh, really? <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Why did you want to learn Mandarin Chinese? Why? Why? Mm, it's kind of a long story.、Uh, make <laughs> well, it short. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll be short. Good. <laughs> hey.、Uh-huh. hey. Um, so it first started because for a while now I had wanted to learn another language, and I really wanted to travel to another country and do like volunteer missionary work and stuff. And I just wasn't sure what language to learn because there's so many, and 
I'll be honest, Chinese was not at the top of my list because everybody says Chinese is the hardest language. You can never learn it. And I was like, I couldn't even learn Spanish in high school. How can I learn Chinese? <laughs> um, so I tried other languages, never really progressed very much. And then I was with some friends of mine who also do missionary work and they were also learning Chinese. And I was like, how do you learn this language? And they started explaining it to me and how enjoyable it's been and how even though there's challenges, you can still overcome those challenges. And they started to explain to me like about the characters and I just got more fascinated with it. Oh, wow. <laughs> and um, then I started studying and I was like, this is actually not as hard as people say it is, I think. Mm -hmm. I think there's... I mean, any language is hard, but a lot of it just made a lot of sense to me. Mm -hmm. So, and I think part of it for me is I am more of a musical person and an artistic person. So Chinese really interested me because of the characters and the tones. And after I started, I just couldn't stop. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. I remember the, you know, before you joined me, you test me by uh, Facebook, right? Mm -hmm. You asked me some questions and then I answered and then you join. And then the next day, because I answer students' question every single day, first thing in the morning. So I turned on my computer. I saw your questions like, wow, this person studies really <laughs> hard. <laughs> <laughs> Because I never received so many questions. Oh, yeah, me. I know. Just want to see you there. But don't <laughs> feel bad. Don't feel bad. Yeah. I'm, I'm just saying, like, I'm su I was surprised that, wow, same person, scroll up, scroll yeah. up, same person. <laughs> I always, even before I joined your course, I, I've told my friends and my family, I'm like, all of my Chinese, like, people that answer my questions probably think I'm a very annoying student because I ask so many questions. <laughs> but that's good. They are like, the question, it means that you really study, like you really, you know, enthusiastic, excited about learning, yeah. you know, Mandarin, like, oh, I got a question, I got to write it down. Yeah. Oh, I got a question, I got to write it down. Yeah. And yeah, so like, wow, this person studies really hard. I better, I better answer her questions like, <laughs> yeah. you know, as, as you know, as as hard as she studies uh, Mandarin, yeah. <laughs> so I think it's very good, right? Thank you. And what is the best thing you think uh, in my course and you want me to keep doing it? Um, I think something that I've really enjoyed is just how much you interact with the students on a personal level mm -hmm. because in the other courses I've done you don't really get to talk to the teacher when you ask questions other people answer and it's really nice to have the teacher themselves answer your questions and you also answer so quickly too <laughs> yeah that's my full-time job <laughs> yeah but I actually schedule like okay today morning I need to do this afternoon so I actually prioritize my schedule that's mm -hmm. why you see me like regularly answering questions yeah. every day almost the same time i answer the questions yes mm -hmm. so you say that other programs they don't have that like, the per teacher personally answer mm -hmm. your questions but still there are other there are people answering your question what's the difference between like the the teacher mm -hmm. like personally answer your question versus like other people in I think the difference that I've seen is that the, for me at least in the courses I've done, the people that answer the questions aren't native speakers of Chinese. Are not? You mean no? Not? Oh. Yeah, they're they're very fluent, and it's nice in a way because they can understand how it is for a learner of the language. But sometimes I think it's really helpful to be able to talk to a native speaker of Chinese when you have a, Chinese, mm -hmm. a question, because oh. sometimes I've had questions and they've answered back, and then they're like oh, wait, I talked to somebody else and they said this is actually the right answer. <laughs> oh, so, oh, that that doesn't feel really like, yeah. like oh, is it is it the correct answer? Your reply, yeah. okay. Oh, I see. I, I mean, they've been able to help me with a lot of things still, um, but I do think it's definitely beneficial to have the teacher or at least a native speaker to help yeah. because, you know, because you understand the language and you're also teaching the language, mm. which is definitely helpful. Because I know for me, even asking some of my Chinese friends, because they're not teachers, they are like, I don't know why we say it this way. <laughs> Maybe this way. Yeah. Why do you say this way? I'm, I don't know. That's the way yeah. we say it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You, like as a foreigner, you hate to receive this answer. It's the way we say it. I right. don't know. <laughs> yeah.
you use because you self studied all all the way. So, do you have any suggestions? Anything you want to say to people who are also self studying, especially this type of people are staying home, you know? Yeah. So, any suggestions, you know, on self studying? Yeah, I'd probably just say don't give up <laughs> because <laughs> it is. You know, because learning a new language it is hard, and、mm. any language can be difficult. And there are times when I first started studying that I thought I can't do this. There are times even now that I'm like I'm not progressing the way I want. But don't give up because you're gonna get over that eventually. And if you keep going, you're just gonna get better and improve more and understand more. And the more you study, the more confident you'll get in your、yeah. own speaking and comprehension. So your first, I, I, I guess your first teacher was、mm -hmm. uh, from mainland China. Do you、mm -hmm. see the differences or challenges when you switch a teacher from mainland China to teacher from Taiwan?、Um, I think with you, there's not really a challenge because you explain both the Taiwanese pronunciation and the mainland Chinese, which、mm -hmm. I appreciate.、Um, <laughs> I think sometimes, I think sometimes the using the traditional characters can be hard. I know when I've commented, I've messed up before, and I'm like,、oh, it's because I'm used to, to simplified characters. I forget how the traditional look, and so I just think, oh, that's the right character. I think. <laughs>、uh -huh. um, besides that, I think, I think it's okay. Like, you know, you have to make. There are certain things that. I know I've asked you like, is this more of a mainland Chinese thing or a Taiwanese thing? Because、uh, I know there are different words you use in each place, and I know I guess it doesn't really matter so much the pronunciation because you understand each other. I know because of learning from a mainland teacher, a lot of times I use that、um, like our Huayin the yeah, R sound R, at the end.、Yes. Yeah, so, but.、Um, But I know that's not like a big thing because you can still understand what we、mm. say. It's not a big thing. The er sound, even、mm. some part of mainland China, they don't have the er sound. Yeah. Anything else before we finish this interview? You want to say encourage people? Yeah, I think the only thing that maybe I would say is like again with like you know keeping up studying. You know, try to do a little bit every day if you can, and also like. I know from my own experience, it's easy to get burned out when you just do the same thing over and over. So, if you do, don't stop studying. Just switch it up a little bit. You know, watch a Chinese movie or listen to music or you know, even that's also even one of the reasons I looked at your course too because I was like, I need something different to encourage、oh. me to keep going. I、um, watch some Netflix, right? Yeah, watch、oh. Netflix. Watch. YouTube videos in Chinese, just something、mm. to keep you studying, but also not, not be too pressure. I guess. Yeah,、not、you can take a、pressure. break, go to sleep,、mm. and come back. Yeah, go to sleep. <laughs> 都可以啊。Yeah. <laughs> oh, 太好了，谢谢你，谢谢。Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah. Interview over. Yeah.